P.S. Amalraj, Chairman, Bar Council of Tamil Nadu and Puducherry, who works tirelessly for espousing the cause of advocates. We now welcome him to deliver this special address. My Lord, the Honorable Chief Justice of India, Honorable Chief Minister of Tamil Nadu, Honorable Mr. Justice V. Rama Subramaniam, Judge Supreme Court, Honorable Mr. Justice M.M. Sudhres, Judge Supreme Court, Honorable Chief Justice of the Madras High Court, Honorable Law Minister, Leonard Advocate General, Honorable Judges of the High Court, Former Judges of the Madras High Court, Former Chief Judges of India, Former CJ of the Jaman Kashmir, Mr. S. Prabhakaran, Vice Chairman, Bar Council of India, Mr. V. Karthi, Vice Chairman, and the other Office Bearer of the Bar Council of Tamil Nadu and Puducherry, the President and the Office Bearer of the All Bar Advocate Associations, and the other dignitaries present on the dice of the dice. Good morning to all. As the Chairman, Bar Council of Tamil Nadu and Puducherry, I wholeheartedly express our gratitude to the Honorable Chief Justice of India, Judges of the Supreme Court, and Chief Justice of this prestigious High Court, who have readily given consent for the request made by the Bar Council to preside over this August function by showing their immense care and profound affection towards the welfare of the legal fraternity. It is our proud that the Honorable Chief Minister, who has for the first time has come this campus and going to distribute the welfare fund checks to the family members of the deceased advocates. The service of the advocate to the society is incredible, but due to sudden death of some advocates, their family members are put to hardship. Therefore, the office bearer of the Bar Council have taken the initiative to bring Tamil Nadu Advocate Welfare Fund scheme to help the family members of the deceased advocate monetarily. And the Tamil Nadu government has also consented for the same. The Tamil Nadu Advocate Welfare Fund Act was enacted in 1987 and implemented in 1990 by providing the death benefit of rupees 50,000. Subsequently, it was increased on several occasions. At present, we are providing a sum of rupees 7 lakh with the funds derived from the sale of stamps and the financial aid of the, the government of Tamil Nadu. As and date, 4,292 advocates family have benefited from this fund. We proud to note at this moment that the Honorable Chief Minister Muttuvel Karnanadi Stalin shows kindness and support to the bar. As like his father, Dr. Kalinjar Karnanadi, former Chief Minister of Tamil Nadu, who was the architect of the welfare measure to the advocates. Even though the release of welfare fund is a great help to the family members of the deceased advocates, due to the hike of the cost of living, at all levels, the existing welfare fund amount is inadequate to sustain themselves. As the chairman of the Bar Council, I take this opportunity to request the Honorable Chief Minister of Tamil Nadu to extend the benevolence of the state government to increase the welfare fund considerably so that the family of the deceased settlement will be able to tide over their personal loss and also provide additional grant of rupees 20 crore to disperse their claims. The advocate profession is born between the court and the government. It is the advocate who argued the case for both the petitioner and the respondent and with the proper advocacy, several good measures are activated. The COVID-19 pandemic has made everyone to realize that the health is wealth and the Honorable High Court also realized the need for some medic claim insurance policy for the advocate and their family members. Accordingly, a committee headed by the advocate general has been constituted to study and implement the same. In this regard, we request the Honorable Chief Minister to bring a family health insurance scheme to the advocates to help them the overcome the financial crisis in the problematic situations. Sir, the advocates play a vital role of the judiciary. As an officer, as an officer of the court, they have to adapt with the evolving new technology, acts and rules. The advocates are required to be well equipped to keep them updated with the fullest knowledge of law. When we took hope as the office bearer of the Bar Council in this auditorium, the Honorable Judges Supreme Court has felt the need of continuous legal education programs with the good libraries and insisted to establish law academy in the state of Tamil Nadu like other states to help the advocates to improve their legal acumen. At this juncture, we request the Honorable Chief Minister to establish law academy to have well-equipped and intellectual lawyers in the noble profession. It is also pertinent to mention here that the most of the court which are newly constructed do not have chambers and other infrastructure and it makes both the advocates and the litigants to face difficulties. 
Therefore, we request the Honorable Chief Minister to take urgent steps to allot separate funds to improve the infrastructure of the courts, including construction of the advocate chamber within the court premises. The role of the lawyer is indispensable in the justice delivery system. It is also observed that the, they are in the irregular income group in the initial stage of practice. They are facing difficulties to meet out the financial needs and to eke out their livelihood. Also, it is more difficult for them to find out their shelter on the rental basis. Hence, we request the Honorable Chief Minister to introduce a housing scheme to the needy advocates. The requirements are all long pending demands and these uh, facilities will uplift the lives of the advocates, not only on the roles of the Bar Council at present, but also the benefit of the entire future generation of lawyers. We hope the same will be considered favorably. We assure that the entire legal yes, the entire legal fraternity thankful for ever the Honorable Chief Minister is parental care towards the legal fraternity. I thank all the dignity see who have done this function and made this as an historic event. Thank you one and all. Thank you very much. Thank you.